is three minute maths and this is one of the videos in the playlist um, that we're looking at surds uh, this particular video is aimed at a a star type questions however i would say it's relatively straightforward looks a little bit scary when you first look at it but it's not too bad so i'm going to give you an example of the question and this will also be written into the description box underneath so it's a right angle triangle the height is six over root two and the length is 6 over root 2 and we're asked to calculate the area. Okay, so when you first look at it you think, oh my goodness, what am I going to do? Well, it's not that hard. It really is straightforward, providing you remember the rules of thirds. And if you have a look at the previous video, the introduction, that'll give you the rules that you need to remember. So, uh, the other thing you need to remember when you're working out the area of a right angle triangle, so the area equals a half base times height. Okay, well let's just plug the numbers into that and see what happens. So we've got a half, I'm going to leave that as a half, and I've got base which is 6 root 2 multiplied by height which is 6 root 2. Okay, now you can hopefully see where this is going because they've made it relatively straightforward for you because a root number multiplied by a root number is the same whole number. Root 2 times root 2 is root 4, and the square root of 4 is 2. Um, okay, so let's just plug those numbers in a little bit further. We've got a half multiplied by 6 times 6, which is 36. And at the bottom, I've got root 4. Well, the square root of 4 is 2, so it's actually 36 divided by 2. Okay, so hopefully now it's not looking so bad because it, the numbers themselves work out fairly neatly. 36 divided by 2 is 18, and 18 multiplied by a half, so it's a half times 18, and a half of 18 is 9. So in answers to this question, it's 9 centimetres squared. So from what was a relatively difficult looking question, it's actually worked out hopefully fairly neatly for you towards the end. I will put the question in the description box underneath as far as I possibly can. Um, this has been 3 Minute Maths. Please subscribe to the site and I look forward to seeing you inside the next video. 17 seconds, yay! <laughs>